Hey guys, so I'm back with another video and today I'm going to be doing another bra haul with you guys. This time it's only three bras. I did send back all of the other ones that I showed you guys in my last video. Um, I went through the comments and I appreciate all the comments that you guys left. There were some really good ones, informative ones and suggestions in the comment section. So shout out to those people. Um, one that left a really good one was, um, I don't wanna forget, I'm gonna mention who left really good comments on my last video. There was Empress and Ace. She left me a really good comment about a particular brand to try out. I did not try there yet, um, the one that she mentioned yet, but she did leave a really good comment and some actually like suggestions on Amazon for me to try out, which I will probably take a look at those once I kind of figure out a size. But Empress and Ace, she left a really good detailed comment so thank you a hundred percent uh another one was broad taylor she was one of the ones that gave me really good detailed comment so i really paid attention to hers um and then there was another one chloe renee she left a really good comment about um bras as well and she was a similar size so i really appreciate the comments um, that you guys left in the last one. Also someone else, I think her name was Catherine. She told me about something called a bra that fits. So thank you to all the constructive criticism, com constructive criticism comments that were left in just helpful information. Again, I'm busty. I've never been this big. I've always had big boobs, but my boobs are a lot bigger than in high school. Okay. My boobs have always been big but they're a lot bigger, okay? Like before I had my daughter, I was like a triple D. Now I'm just beyond the Ds and all that kind of stuff. So I appreciate all the helpful comments that were left under my last video. I definitely appreciate it. The ones who just left comments like, none of those bras fit you. You need to go up a size. I, I, I know that. I, I, I said that in the video, if you, if you watch the video, like I know that I said that. I don't need you to repeat what I said in the video because I know what I said in the video and if you probably watched the video and was listening to what I was saying, you would know that I, I know that. So, shout out to the people who left great, amazing, constructive criticism and suggestions, which is kind of like the point of videos like this. Suggestions, not just like, oh, well girl, you need to go up a size. I, I know that, I said that, just so we're clear. So, so if you guys want to see the bras that I got this time and how they fit and what I think about them, um, definitely stay tuned for the video. <music> I have three bras to show you. Look, I said three bras. That's not three. This is three right now. Three bras to show you guys that I ordered. Um, after the first video, I read through the comments and looked at some of the suggestions. Excuse me. I also looked at, I also reached out to like Bare Necessities. They have like a bra expert where you can like chat with and, you know, tell them your issues and they'll give you suggestions. So one of the girls um, from the Bare Necessity site, she told me to try a, in, in US sizing, she said try the 34H which I did order one bra that was a 34H. And then I also, um, reading some of the comments, someone mentioned in the UK sizes, try to go up to like the double H's G kind of area. So I did order one bra that was a, cause I wasn't sure about doing, going up a band size or not. I'm pretty sure the band size was a good idea based off of the ones I tried on. So I did order one bra in a 32 double H, one bra in a 34 double H, and one bra in a 34H US. The ones that are double H's are UK sizing. So anything that's a double H is in UK sizing. In the US, they, it, I ordered a 34H. So I ordered two bras from Curvy Kate because actually out of the last bra haul, I really enjoyed the quality of the Curvy Kate bras. So I kind of went back to that particular bra i only i think i only from that haul i think i had one bra that was curvy cape but that was the one that i liked the construction 
of the bra the most as far as like how sturdy it was, the little like silicone grips, the thickness of the band, those types of things. I really liked that bra, so I did order two bras from there. The first one that I ordered was, I, rep I repurchased that tan bra from Curvy Kate that I said that I liked and I wished it would have fit. That bra I did reorder. However, I ordered it now in a 30, two double H, which this is the bra. Actually, I was a lot more, uh, once I saw the size of the H, I was a lot more like calm about trying on these bras because I felt like the cup size actually looked more fitting. So as far as the cup size, it looked more fitting and not like what in the world. So I did try this bra on, it did fit for the most part, um, but I should have went up in a band side, which I mentioned in the last video, I should have done, should have done was go up in the band size, definitely need like a 34 double H. I feel like this part um, here in the middle fit, but it was a little too snug and it wasn't because of the cup part of it, it was because of the band. I felt like the, like I had to like pull to get to the first hook. Um, so I knew the band was a little too small and I'll, like, I'll explain why as we get to the other two sizes that were a 34 H and a double H. So I felt like I had to pull a little bit too much, which was creating a little bit of tension. Um, like almost like pulling here. Um, the sides, I actually was, wasn't upset about the sides. The sides weren't too bad, but again, I think the bands, the band portion of, of it was a little too small. I wish there was kind of like a half mark, like a 32 and a half or like a 33 band size or something like that. But I'd rather go up in the band size and then I can always sew, you know, sew it to a 33 because I, I, I got a sewing machine. I could, um, cause I feel like a 34 is like a little too big, but a 32 is gonna be too small. Um, but I don't know. So this bra did fit again. This is just like that tan bra that I tried on the last one. Sorry. Um, it had the boning here on the front, which it, there's no actual boning in it, but it has like that look. Um, I love the thickness of the side of the band. I really, really like that. It did have some nice boob size. The straps are pretty thick and I enjoy, I like the fact that it had four um, hook eye back here. I know some people are like, don't, don't worry about it having two, but I just know me and the heaviness of my boobs, like bras with two rows of, of bands just do not last on me at all. Even when I was a, triple D they don't last on me um, like I'll buy them if it's cute but I'm also I buy them with the impression that I know it's not gonna last me long so if I'm gonna spend sixty dollars seventy dollars on a bra I need it to to last okay because bras aren't cheap and I just can't go to Walmart and get a damn bra yeah her all right so the next bra this is in a US size this is a 34 H bra I really oh, I loved how this bra fit the only okay so let's let's start here this brand is from Chantel this was actually the sizing that the bare necessities bra expert uh, recommended she recommended this brand and she recommended this size she rec recommended two brands specifically but I ordered from this one um, because I ordered from this, I didn't order from this brand in my last haul, so I wanted to try something different. Um, so this is from Chantel. Um, I don't know what the name of this bra is. Again, I'll have the pictures in the video like I did last time. Um, but I ordered this one in a 34H US, and I loved how this bra fit. I feel like this probably fit the closest of like just fitting perfectly. Um, I really, really like how this bra fit. This was again a 34H. And um, I liked that um, the, they had this extra side for the side support. I will say with the 34 and the H, there was like a, not a lot of space. Like you guys saw in the video, like 
a little space, but nothing like too major. Like I said, if this was like a 33, it probably would have fit like exactly like perfect, but going down to a 32 H would have just been too, too tight to me because I felt like this was like fitting just right, but it was just a little space as far as like the band, there was just a little bit of space on the side boob action. So, and not like, not anything to be upset about, honestly. So I think I'm gonna end up keeping this bra um, cause I did actually love the fit. I love that there is no lining. I am not a big fan of lining. You guys, I told you that in my last video. If you think your nipples are gonna show, just wear some pasties. But I just love, cause I have, I have enough fullness, okay? Um, so I love that it's lined, but there's no like padding, added padding. So I liked that a lot. It's super pretty bra. I actually really like a good kind of everyday bra in just, I was really happy when, when I tried this bra. And this was probably the one that I was like the happiest in, or like the, oh, she fit in. Okay, and then the last bra that I got is from Curvy Kate again as well. I ordered this in a 34 double H UK sizing, which it says US 34L. Nonetheless, Again, this is not um, any padding. It is like thinly lined, so you can kind of see through it. So it's a kind of thin line. Um, I did like this bra as well. Um, I think it fits pretty nice. The bands are super thick on the side. They're really, really thick. I like that the side here is pretty thick. Um, just a super, it's a pretty bra. Another, I don't want to say everyday bra because it's a little sexy. I mean, I guess for me it would be sexy. Um, I do love that it has um, it has three hooks on this one, so that's really nice as well. Again, I like how wide this part is. I am like a sucker for bras that are like this. I felt like this one fit really good as well, guys. I'm sure you guys will let me know what you guys think. But I love the detailing on this bra. On this bra, um, it's like very kind of floral lacy up here and then it's kind of like more of a meshy kind of material down here um, with a very thin lining underneath. It's not it's not thick at all. Not like super thick. It's a really thin mesh kind of lining, which I'm OK with. But I like this bra. I did like this bra. I think I'm going to keep this one as well. Um, um, so yeah, so those were, those were the three bras that I got this time. I'm actually a little bit, a lot more happy than I was when I ordered the first time because I don't feel like I just wasted money. Even though I was able to return those bras, obviously I didn't waste anything, but I feel like with these bras, like they did come through. So I'm kind of happy. Um, the only one that I am definitely going to return is the 32 Double H from Curvy Kate. I may just exchange it and get the 34 double H because I feel like that's going to be like the exact match for me for this bra because I like that this bra is convertible and I think that's why I keep repurchasing it and hoping that it fits because it is a convert convertible bra and I just really need a convertible bra. I just love a convertible bra um, and it can be strapless and it has like the little silicone um, thing here. So I think that's kind of why I keep reordering this bra because I really like it. And so I'm going to try and order a 34 double H in this and see how that goes. If that goes well, then I think we found some winners and I think we found my about me size. So I appreciate all the comments that were left under the video. Again, like I said before, because those really helped me select these particular bras. So shout out to you guys. And yeah, hopefully I'll be able to come through and do some more bra videos. Um, I do still have like the boob tape and stuff that I bought that I'm going to be trying out as we're able to go back outside and I can actually wear some of my outfits. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, I will leave a link for all the bras that I ordered down below and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.